Hey guys, it's me. Welcome back to Piggy Theater's Beauty. It has been a long, 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 long time. Emphasis on long. I uh, took a break from YouTube due to, I felt that YouTube was not, um, at the time, the platform that I wanted to be on. Um, had to kind of reevaluate some stuff and figure out what it is that I wanted to do, basically for myself and life just happened. Um, when it came to YouTube, I feel YouTube is a great platform. I feel, feel that sometimes people use YouTube not necessarily in the best way and people aren't authentic with the content that they're bringing. Um, so I just wanted to make sure that when I come and I'm here and I'm talking to you all that I'm being authentic with who I am and what it is I represent. I feel that this channel will be about everything. I feel that this channel will be a representation of me, an African-American woman in her late 30s, talking about things that matter to me, talking about beauty, talking about life, uh, marriage, prayerfully, uh, in the near future, motherhood. So I want to just bring you everything there is about me. I had a lot of stuff going on the last past two years. Um, good things, bad things, most of them good things. My husband and I uh, purchased our first home. We moved two years ago. I had surgery twice since then. Um, foot surgery and uh, surgery to move fibroids, which I will do a, another video talking about that in depth. We had a first son, Duke, that's two. He is a lot. It's it's a child that just has fur on that you can you can take some places and some places you can't and you can leave that child home. That's the only difference between to me with a fur child and a real child. They're still children that just he just has fur on. <laughs> um so this is my little my beauty area here, and I have my perfume is in that little thing and then my body sprays and my candles are down at the bottom. I have two Alex drawers here. One has planner stuff in it. That's another thing that I'm like really big into is planner stuff. So one has planner stuff in it and then one has my makeup in it. Then I have a couple like makeup drawers here that has makeup. I did go through makeup. I downsize. Makeup for me has changed. Um, I probably still need to go through some of the makeup I got and downsize and change it again because Lord knows I got a lot of it. And I haven't been wearing makeup. I mean, who really has been wearing makeup? Wearing COVID, excuse me, all of this is covered. So who's wearing makeup? I don't know. It's just not me. I'm not wearing makeup like that. Uh, let's see what else. So I want to do uh, work on the schedule. My first scheduling is that I'm going to try to do a video, one video per week. I want to be more consistent with what I'm doing in my content. So one video a week is what I'm, I'm aiming for at the moment. I'm going to try to get to two and maybe three, but I'm gonna say more between two and one video just to be consistent first. And then the more consistent I become, the more videos that I may may give. Um, I wanna do, of course, beauty videos. My, my favorite videos probably would be current favorites or favorite, like favorite the, of the month. Those videos are my favorite. I love talking about products. I love talking about um, the experience of the product, if I like the product, didn't like the product, perfumes. Perfumes or scents in general is just a love of mine. So I always will talk about probably perfumes because I love perfumes. I think I'm going to do a, a new video talking about perfumes where I make it where it's like winter video, a winter and fall perfumes and then spring and summer perfumes. I think I'm going to talk about that. Let's see, what else? Current books that I'm that I'm reading or liking or current shows. Um, get ready with me videos. We'll see exactly where I'm going to be at and what I'm going to be talking about. But I just wanted to come and kind of do a re-entry video. My name is, I'm going by Piggy Thea Beauty. That's my nickname. My nickname is Piggy. Miss Piggy, if I'm going to be technical about it. Um, from South Carolina, born and raised. Moved to Maryland when I was 18. I'm a nurse. I've been a nurse for... 11 years, 
11 years, 12 years, something like that. Don't quote me. It's 11, 12, when I'm, but I've been in medical field for almost 20 years. January would be 20 years. I love taking care of others. Um, it's a passion of mine. It's something that I, I feel like I will always do. I enjoy taking care of people and giving people care and, and loving people and being there for people when they need uh, care. It's, it's something that I love doing. I've been doing for a long time. I'm repping my Ravens, y'all. I'm repping my Ravens purple. Love football. Love my Ravens. I'm repping, repping my Ravens jersey. My Ravens jersey. It's Friday. So in Merlin, it's Purple Friday. Look, I got my purple, my purple uh earrings on. And I got my purple jersey on. Gotta rep, gotta rep the Ravens on, on Fridays. It's Purple Friday in, in, in Baltimore. A purple Friday in general in Merlin. And not everybody lives in Merlin, uh, Merlin fans. But I am. I'm a, I'm a Die Hard Ravens fan. Well, not get a Ravens tattoo, but I'm a Die Hard Ravens. Because some people from Maryland got Ravens tattoos. Ain't finna do that. It's just a little bit too much. What else I want to talk about? Uh, I had I lost a close friend of mine in August. The same age as I am. She passed away. Um, still dealing with, with her death. It's very, very hard for me. Um... Still dealing with it, still, and in a sense, I still can't believe that she she she's gone and she's not here. In my mind, I I don't think I really really have put two and two together that she is not physically with us. I I know spiritually she's with us, but physically I know she's not. So that that was a a big blow, um, and that was that was when I found out I had to have surgery, um, and I had surgery maybe a month and a couple of weeks after her passing. So all of that was really, really difficult. Just with everything going on, especially with COVID now, people are passing away and that weren't necessarily sick, but due to COVID they passed and hers was not COVID related. Um, but, you know, people are passing away and, and you, you see people losing loved ones every day. Um, and it's, it's difficult right now. We're right now. It, everything is different. Everything is difficult. Everything is a lot. We had the presidential election. That was a lot. Um, the tension dealing with the presidential election, the tension before the presidential election, the tension with the president we had or currently have in office. Um, it, it, it blew and grew with a lot of tension. Um, I pray and my prayer that we all can find peace and we all can have unity and love each other as we are, regardless of, regardless of skin color, regardless of relig religious preference, sexual preference, um, economical status, background, education, all that stuff. That stuff is like, to me, it's, it's unimportant. It's not important. You as a person is, is important and, and anything else to me, it just doesn't, it doesn't matter. It really, really doesn't. But prayerfully... We can just push all that aside and just come together. Um, I did my face. Nothing really serious that I did to my face. I think I have CoverGirl um, makeup stick on. This is um, Vampire by Urban Decay that I have on my lips with chestnut um, lip pencil. This, I think, on my eyes is like L'Oreal. And um, Shea Moisture had makeup, which they don't have makeup anymore. But this is a Shea Moisture um eyeshadow that I have on my base. My eyebrows need to be done, but they aren't. Um oh and then I did a big chop on my hair. So I cut all my hair off in July. Literally all my hair off in July. And I love it. My hair was purple. It's not purple anymore. I put a rinse on top of it because the purple was starting to look kind of like the color on the wall, which I wanted a, a deeper purple like this in my hair. It was, but over time it got to that color and I was like, oh no, I don't like that. It's too light. So I just put a little rinse over it. Um, what else do I have? Better than sex mascara on. Nothing. I don't have anything particular on my face to be completely honest. I just put some makeup on because I wanted to look nice talking to y'all. That's all. So basically I want to just come to you guys. I probably want to do videos. Um, like every other Monday, every other Friday due to my work schedule, that's probably how I'm going to do it. And then I may try to do a video on my 
like a weekend, like a weekend video. I may do try to do something on like Sundays or something like that every other weekend when I do get up to two videos. But for right now, it'll be one video. So one Monday, it'll be a video. Then it'll be that Friday, the next week, and then the Monday, the week after, and then Monday, the week after that. That's kind of how I'm going to do it. So I just wanted to do a video and tell y'all where I've been. A lot has happened. I kind of like really shortened this because I didn't go in depth with everything that was going on. But I will be doing a video about my fibroid removal uh, surgery. I will be doing a video and I probably will have this on, to be completely honest. So I um, just wanted to come and say where I've been, what was going on. And then I am back. I pray that everybody is well. Remember to be uh, beautiful inside and out. Remember to love yourself. Remember to always, always be blessed. Until next time. Bye, y'all.